Draymond, you can see the effort on the floor and the effort to improve. Would that make this whole situation a lot more miserable, being stuck on 10 wins, if you couldn't see that you guys cared? Uh, I mean, 10 wins is 10 wins, regardless of how much effort you get. If it don't turn into wins, it, I mean, I guess it's good for down the road, but all right, good to see you, bro. Um, still want to win the game. Or two. You're, uh, since your since your sophomore year in high school, you've gone. You've had a winning percentage of 747. You've never had a losing season like, since you were a teenager. What's what's this been like? It's hard. Yeah. Yeah. But that's the worst problems in life. Steve said that you you've handled that. You've kind of taken the reins as as, as being the only guy. Left over from from who's actually playing from the uh, from the five teams that went to the finals. Like you're taking that and, and, and running with it in terms of being a leader. Yeah, I mean, you know, the young guys, you know, it's kind of rolling in right now. It's my responsibility. So, I'm to see. I'm sure I'll do that. How good do you think this team can be next year? Do you know anything about that? Um, I think we can be good, but I don't spend every day thinking about how good we could be or will be next year. Draymond, you make. Steve also said it's competitive. But is it a particular challenge to self motivate? I wouldn't necessarily say to self motivate. Um, I think it's more so just understanding the circumstances and not being overly aggressive. Like, just trying to be more understanding than self motivated. Steve said that uh, one of the things that impresses him about Jason Tatum is he's learning the NBA really quickly. You know, he's still a young age, but knows what he can get away with, knows the opponent now. Do you see that as an opposing player in, in Tatum's games? Yeah. Um, he plays like a seasoned vet. Uh, you know, he's gotten a lot of experience in his first couple of years, but you know, he continues to get better. That's a good sign. The Celtics have one of the best defenses in the league. Did you guys kind of feel like this could be a game where you would have to play a bill? Uh, I mean, you know, we're coming to the game thinking you're going to play a bill, but you know, uh, their defense is good. And we didn't quite get it figured out, but they were good. You went through this obviously on Tuesday night, Draymond, but tonight another Kobe Bryant tribute. Uh, any thoughts, reaction to what happened before the game and, and what the Celtics did in paying tribute? I think it was a great tribute. Um, you know, for me, as a basketball fan, for my entire life to come in this building and see so many Kobe jerseys, and you know, obviously Celtics Lakers is a heat arriver, but just to see so many Kobe jerseys on obvious Boston fans. Uh, it was special, uh, definitely special to see. Great. Thank you, Draymond.